99 The Buzz, The Sunday Night Shakedown. The Grinders, My Poor Dog. Todd D'Antico, the man that's made one guitar solo last for about 10 years and is beautiful. I never get tired of it before that BML, which is doing that for They played a fantastic show. I heard over at Wondersuit Music Hall on Friday. I went down there, saw Salako, waited forever. Huge crowd, man. The metal scene is all right. Jim Flash Heroes before that. And now, a sensation on MySpace. A video sensation on MySpace. In fact, there's a video up now. Is it on, on the uh, Shakedown page Yeah, it's on well? the Shakedown page. If you go to rochesterbuzz.com, click on the Shakedown link, and uh, just follow the instructions there. You can see the video. Of Nora Kaminsky, emo boyfriend on the buzz. So I'm kind of going to get like, this overall feeling from a newbie standpoint. It seems like everything is even sort of the pop stations has this pervasive rock and roll element to it. Whereas now, anything, you can either have hip-hop, glossy pop, or the, the only guys that are wielding less pulse now are like, you know, are like, we're so tough and tired, and everything sounds the same, but they, there's rock, and you know, like Wolf Mothers from there, Jets from there. There's a lot of that, the, the sort of undercurrent. So many bands I hadn't heard of, so, but even without knowing them, like, this is cool, this is cool, this is great. There's a band down there called Airborne, that's called like the next ACDC, I know it's a label, uh, 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 Cheap way labeling them, but it's good. Right? It seems that that seems to be the undercurrent. Bands that have more of a real, to, to my generation, a real rock right. um, push, as opposed to like this. The teenage girls dig this, and the thing is, the teenage girls down there do probably or wouldn't be on the radio, would it? Right. I ate some kangaroo. I pet one too. I brought I brought back uh, Ferris and the boys. Uh, these, these chains purses that are made out of kangaroo scrotums. Wow. Put it up on the, uh, <laughs> on the website. <laughs> like, thanks. Uh, Couldn't get my damn camera to focus on it, right? You're too close to the ball bag, first. Step away from the ball bag. Uh, I had a nickel for everything. <laughs> yeah, 15 cents. I did this fantastic shoot with this model thing on that Karen naked with a shotgun. In the snow? Yeah, but I am uh, wearing like this fur, this pabushka fur hat and, and boots. But I keep watching my, this old lady by name like freaks out on her. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm call a cops, Frank, this is my neighborhood. <laughs> but like, you can do naked. Well, you can do topless, but she was naked, but I'm going to have to tell her. I think she's in a G-string, you know? I'll show you a The first time I met her, if you remember, Yes, I remember this vividly because I, the one time I got, I got, bu I got busted a couple of hours ago, but I didn't do it. She had a, a Sex Pistols t-shirt on that day. Like, you know, like never mind how the newspaper rip shredding and the queen of the buzz up. I was checking it out, but it was kind of like, it was a really like, cool shirt. And she's like, oh, you know, like I was looking at the kiss and I, well, she grabbed it, but I was looking at the t-shirt. And, and then once we got to be friends, so I knew that, she's kind of like, you know, you were staring at like, you know what? I've heard I do that all the time anyway, but in this case, I, I wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> one, one, one time I know, I was going to do that. I was going to do that. Shakedown, Rochester's answer to everything. That's right. Where do babies come from? When a mommy and daddy love each other very much. All right, maybe we shouldn't answer. And they goose their juice with a glug of Jim Beam. It's the Sunday Night Shakedown, ladies and gentlemen. And in the studio right now, we have El Destructo. It's, it's a regular visit. We got Ed and we got Ryan, who is essentially the Rochester uh, Colonel Tom Parker for all destructo. <laughs> what do you say, guys? What's going on, Ferris, Frank? What's up? I just I got home last week and I looked in the paper and said, "Damn it, John Sinclair was in town." Oh yeah. How was that, man? It was fantastic. Really? Did did it take five five seconds for revolution, or has it gotten yeah. longer as you get older? <laughs> a little bit longer, but it was still there. He kicked out the jams at Daily Perks Coffee House. Yes, he did. Damn it. And who knows when he's coming back. He lives in Holland or something, or Amsterdam or something. He, was, he said something about living in New Orleans, but I don't know where he is now. Something, I, I guess, right in the Democrat. But anyhow, El Destructo's got a new CD, Cumbra Vieja. And Ryan, you were you're describing this as a, uh, did I say it right? Yep, Cumbre Vieja. And it's a, it's a mountain that's going to turn into a volcano and sink America? It is a mountain that is a volcano. Okay. <laughs> And it's supposed to like erupt and shear off, and then send a killer wave, uh, destroying the east coast. This east, our east coast, our east coast, yes. Well, this, and so when is this happening, Ryan? Uh, twenty twelve. Sure. Twenty twelve. Said it could happen. Uh, There's a little bit of debate about that. Twenty twelve is correct. But I thought it was appropriate because uh, El Destructo destruction. So. Well, they did say, you know, Nostradamus did say this is the last pope. You know, he's a, he's a knucklehead anyway. 
Here in the Sunday Night Shakedown, we do not acknowledge the Pope. But we acknowledge Elder Struggle with his brand new CD. You, got, you guys got a show coming up uh, February 24th, right? Yes, at the Bug Dyer with the uh, Point Devils. Yeah, why not? And uh, Rocco Dorsey out of Albany. Ithaca or Albany, something like that. Yeah. Um, Point Devils, they any good? The, the, I, I love they them. They suck. Not on the first date, though. But, but listen, you're not in, in uh, um, the Cheetah Horrors anymore. No, I uh, gracefully bowed out of the Cheetah Horrors. Was that, the, was that the plan all along, just to kind of get, get them started? No, no, no. Um, I sang a song with them. Oh, great. Ferris, listen. Bandert coming. Bandert alert. Bandert. Oh, Bandert. no, no. Nothing like that. It's, it was six girls and one guy. It was kind of a very I emotional the eyes, man. practice. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah very emotional practice is concerned. Right, especially once the menstrual cycle's all like insane. Yeah. yeah. Holy cow. Yeah, I hear El Destructo can be quite a bitch. When he's on the rag, right? <laughs> so on the new CD, this is El Destructo. This is Shake It Part 1 on the Sunday yeah, night. Some brand new El Destructo. Sound like Jim Carroll kind of, man. A little, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll call them the Baseball Diaries instead, right? Not Basketball. Yeah. yeah. They don't play basketball. Uh, I'm a stick man. So who's, who's the band? Uh, this band on this album is uh, Ryan Kemp, who's with us now. Oh, right. Oh, okay. And uh, my buddy Jim Hansen was playing bass. So who's the, who's the band, I guess, in the rest of the record is what I'm asking? Is it, is all, is all oh, it's pretty much all us. Okay. Uh, Paul Morbido, oh, right Francisco right. Kings plays yeah. drums on some tracks. And uh, the Love Maddox. Yeah, Love yeah, Maddox days. Love Maddox. Hodge plays bass, right? Hodge 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 is playing but Ryan, bass. you're no longer playing um, in the group, or are you back playing with them? Or? Oh, yeah, well, I play guitar in the group now. Which oh, is, wow, okay. Which, yeah. is, oh, a, yeah. which is a change. <laughs> He's doing great. The new band is killer. Can't wait to hear it live again. Um, you guys got a web page or is this the MySpace? Uh, it's the MySpace. It's just Zelda Structure LTD. Uh, MySpace slash Zelda Structure LTD. And then there's um, the website for the label, which is um, cashmatic.com. CMI Records. Super groovy. You got the show on February 24th. We're going to play another track of the brand new El Destructo CD. You can get it anywhere that matters. The song here is called Nancy on the Sunday Night Shakedown. Thanks, boys. Great break, guys. Yeah. yeah. Well, we're, we're